30 degrees. That was straightforward. Next one is a graph question, and not a graph question, it's more like a gradient question, similar to that. Straight line, L1, so you remember y is equal to mx plus c, where m is the gradient, c is the y-intercept, okay? So c is the y-intercept, y-intercept. So this is involving perpendicular equations. We would like to put our coordinates there. Find the coordinates of a point where L2 crosses the x-axis. So we know that for perpendicular equations, it is opposite recipro reciprocal slopes, okay? So wh what we're going to start off is y is equal to 6 minus 2x. We would like to rearrange this in the form of y equals mx plus c. Once we rearrange that, we have to find out the gradient and find the opposite reciprocal slope. So the opposite recipro reciprocal slope will be a positive half. Then we create a new equation with a new gradient of m half x plus c. Then we use the straight line L2 is perpendicular to L1. We use the coordinates 4 and 7. So we input 7 in y, half of 4 plus c. We find out what c is through, uh, through substitution, and we should be getting about 5. Okay, once you find out that, you can directly put it in your value of half x plus 5. Right, so now they asked us to find out the coordinates where it crosses the x-axis, right? So they asked us to find out the coordinates, right? So we have to just give it uh, y as 0. Once you put y as 0, you should be solving it by getting minus 10. x should be minus 10. And once you put x equals minus 10 into this equation, you should be getting as y is equal to 0. So x is minus 10, 0. Okay, so it's a matter of substitution. So